Hello guys, myself Hamid in this video, we shall see another problem on the code. Reverse string. So write a function to reverse a string, but the condition here is constraint is given as input string is given as arrow of characters. We must do this by modifying the input with array in place and with only we go of one extra memory. So we can take only one extra variable as a extra space to handle this condition and we have to do modification in place. So given the array, hello, it's E, L, L, O. I won't be including in the commas. Just for example purpose and everything. So if we reverse the string, it will be O, L, L, E, H. So if you observe what we do is we exchange these two, then we exchange these two, and this will be in place exchange. This is for even uh, odd number of characters. If it is even number, let's say H E L L O and S. So in this case, exchange these two, then exchange these two, then exchange these two. So it doesn't matter even or odd, you will be reversing the two positions, one from the first and the from the end. Then again this increment, this decrement. Again okay, from the end, uh, first and end. Then again, again increment this position, decrement this position. And you execute it itself. In this case, we start first and last. So extend these two. Then increment, then decrement. Again extend these two. Then an increment, then this decrement, extend these two. So that's how you do it. So for doing this operation, we need the extra variable called temp. So what we will do is, at first, we, before exchange, for exchanging H and O, we store the H in temp. So once you store H in temp, now we replace the H position with temp. So let's say this is S of I. This is S of uh, N minus I. Minus one. How is it n minus i? So this is the last length. Length n is nothing but uh, length of the array. Minus i. I is zero. Minus one. So it will be uh, uh, given to the last one. For this position, i will be uh, one, right? So for this position, i will be one here. So this is i equal to one. For this position, s of n. N is one, two, three, four, five. Five minus one. Minus one. So 5 minus 1 minus 1 is 3. So 0, 1, 2, 3. It's pointing here. So S of, so this is nothing but S of i. i is equal to h. Next, what to do is, once you store this value in the temp variable, now you assign this value to this position. Now, so S of i equal to S of n minus i minus 1. That is nothing but h is equal to uh, none. This position will be equal to o, sorry, what is zero? Uh, not o. So once you assign this o to this position, now replace this position's value with the h. That is step. So s of n minus i minus one is equal to step. So how till where we do this? Half of the array. Half of the array is something but n by n is the length of the array. Length by 2. In this position, we will do. So, 1 to the 5 by 2 is something like 2.5, that is 2, 0, 1, 2 position. In this case, if it is 6, length is 6, 6 by 2, 3, 0, 1, 2, 3. 0, 1, 2, 3. Uh, I mean, lesser than n by 2. So, we give, uh, if it is 6, 6 by 2, 3. So, lesser than 3 means 0, or uh, 0, 1, 2. If it is 5, 5 by 2 is nothing but 2, because 2.5 will be rounded off to 2 since we give it as 1. So 0, 1. This 2 only will be exchanging, and this L will remain as it is. Here also this will be in this position and exchange will happen. So we will quickly write the code. So in n equal to s dot length. So after this, in 10 equal to. 0 initially, so that 
we are using only one extra variable. This is for finding the length, that's fine. But for doing modifying the input term, we are using only one extra variable as in what, as what they have to. So for in i equal to 0, i lesser than n by 2 and i plus plus. So now we store. This is one extra. Okay. Now here, in a temp, we store the temp equal to s of i. So once you store temp equal to s of i, now modify s of i equal to the last uh, character from the second half of the year, s of n minus i minus 1. Then modify s of n minus i minus 1 equal to s uh, equal to temp. So since the function is written in void, you need not to return anything. You will be doing the modifying uh, the input array in place. S of n minus i. Possibly loss of conversion to character. Okay, this should be character because other element is containing a character. That's all. Yeah, we should submit this. It's successfully submitted. If you have any doubts, please drop it in the comment section. And keep running my sector to your channel. Thank you.